Today, we're going to be talking about the Wise Phone, which is an intentionally dumb phone or a minimalist phone that is actually pretty impressive. One of the better ones that I've gotten my hands on. I've been using it for about the last two months. As you guys know, I'm a fan of intentional technology, technology that encourages you to be with people in your life. I'm not a fan of technology that tries to suck you and distract you. I've had quite a bit of dumb phones. I've also had smartphones. And one of the biggest videos I have, the most viewed is on the Light Phone 2, which is right here. But I've also had the Sonom Scout, which is a flip phone. And I've had whatever this is, the TCL Flip Go, I think. I hate flip phones, they suck. And I couldn't do the Light Phone much longer. It was way too difficult to use and kind of infuriating at times. And lately, recently, about two months ago, the Wise Phone reached out to me and asked me if I would just check it out. So I guess this is my first sponsored video. The Wise Phone, <sighs> guys, I'm gonna be honest. If you're trying to quit smartphone addiction and you've got an issue and you need more than a tissue, that this is a good uh, this is a great start and that the exciting thing is they have a second one coming so let's just really quick talk about it but before i do there's a really good really in-depth review it's like 23 minutes by spencer scott pew i think i'm saying his last name right you need to check out that video as well he does a great job talking about it i'm not going to do an in-depth review on the phone okay i'll talk about basic features why you might want it and who might want it and honestly, why it's better than the Light Phone 2. And I, I have vested interest in both because I'm an affiliate for both. So if I was going to recommend one, I'm going to recommend the Wise Phone. And here's why. So the Wise Phone has different tools and such. They have the clock, calculator, maps. The GPS is actually pretty impressive, works pretty well. It looks good. It's attractive. I don't know if it's Google Maps or what, but it's, it's, a, it's a good GPS. I used it to get to work a few times in different places, and I had no issues with it compared to Google Maps my, on my smartphone. Phone. There's a notes app, there's a camera, and there's a flashlight. And I'll tell you the one thing that I like the most about this phone is how the flashlight turns on by shaking it. Apple, make that a thing on the iPhone. Life changing. I love it. <laughs> I literally would just sit here and do this with this phone. You can also take pictures and view photos. I'll be honest, the camera, not amazing. I think the front facing is like 5 megapixels and the rear's 13 or something. Hey guys, video editing Trevor here. I just wanted to say really quick, I tried getting a video with the Wise Phone um, to send to you guys, but if it's longer than 10 seconds, you can't share it through text. And it kind of was cumbersome to share it to my Mac, so I'm not gonna do that because I just wanna, I wanna edit this video, right? So just keep that in mind when you think about well, what if I wanna create content still, you're gonna need a dedicated camera for that. You're not gonna wanna use the Wise Phone. But if you don't need that, then this phone is still great and the camera is totally acceptable. But that's not why you're buying this phone. You're buying this phone for a digital detox and compared to the other options on the market, it's just so much more realistic for a long-term detox. That's why I would recommend this phone. If you want to step away from your smartphone, someone like my wife who barely ever uses her smartphone, probably wouldn't need it, probably wouldn't care. My wife doesn't do social media, has no interest. My wife never gets on her phone for more than an hour a day. She's just very anti-technology, so the phone's never been addicting for her. Someone like me, however, who is very pro-technology and I love technology, this is a great option to help detox or get away from the smartphone, which can so quickly suck you in, especially I have ADHD, so I can get sucked in really easy i can't believe i just threw the phone up like that who would i give this phone to who would I, who would who do i think could use it well that that's who but especially i'll be honest i'm getting my kid one of these when he's 10 11 12 there are things on the internet that i don't want my son to be able to look up just yet no matter what your values are we can all agree that some content is not child friendly whether you think it's appropriate for adults or not that's another story but i'm saying the great thing about this phone is what it can't do it has no web browser, it has no email, it has no social media. So your child is not going to get sucked into stupidity, but the great thing is it looks like a smartphone still. And so the fact that it looks like a smartphone makes it a lot easier to carry around and your friends aren't gonna make fun of you, which although who cares if your kid's friends make fun of him, like be confident, be you, but at the same time, peer pressure is a real thing, you don't want your kid to feel stupid. My final disclosure for you would be this. I gotta be honest, I have a smartphone. I'm filming this video on the iPhone 15. I love my iPhone, but I did two years, two years on this phone. So I did a super detox. And when I got back into the smartphone world, I was very careful about what I allowed myself to consume. If you're struggling, I highly recommend this phone. 
highly. If you want more, go check out Spencer's video on his channel. 300 bucks for this thing. If you want one, you can buy one in the description below. Hey guys, video editing Trevor here. And I just wanted to touch base with something that I completely forgot to mention. One, if you are looking into a phone, and you want a minimalist phone, I recommend the Wise Phone 2. However, the date's undetermined of when that's gonna be out, and I think the Wise Phone 1 is a perfectly acceptable option. All right, video editing, Trevor, for the last time, hopefully. If you're looking to buy the Wise Phone 1, you're gonna have to get it used on eBay or something. They still support it. Otherwise, you need to pre-order the Wise Phone 2. I missed that point. Just wanted to throw that out there. If you order, in June or July, which I know June is gone. So if you order in July, you get $75 off of Wise Phone using my code. And you'll go to techlist.com slash Trevor and you'll use the code Trevor at checkout. You do that, I get a kickback. It helps out a lot. And it's like a win-win situation for us both. Like I said, I am an affiliate for this and a light phone. I like both phones. They didn't force me to say anything positive. They sent me the phone and said, do with it what you will. So they were so confident in their product, they were gonna let me completely destroy it. It's a great phone, I highly recommend. Check it out, $75 off in the month of July. God bless guys, as always, and take it easy.